We decided to work with sub-Saharan African countries for our study on the use of learning assessment data. First of all, because their national assessment systems received less attention in the existing literature, and also because it is UNESCO's regional priority. Then in the region, we wanted to choose countries that have functional national assessment systems and that have ideally participated in either SACMEC or PASEC regional assessment, or that have a very well-developed national large-scale assessment. So we ended up working in six countries, the Gambia, Guinea, Namibia, Zambia, Senegal, and Ghana. But now our office in Buenos Aires is actually implementing the same study with an adapted version in Latin America. IIP partnered with national research teams in each country in order to carry out the study and the teams helped us to organize data collection and also analyze the results. We traveled to almost all project countries and conducted interviews, focus group discussions as well as observations with national researchers and this was indeed a very great experience. Um, then we also had an opportunity to exchange more informally with Ministry of Education officials and also civil society representatives, which definitely enriched the results of the study. Um, so as a result of the study, uh, six policy briefs are being released and we are mostly targeting countries that participated in the project. Uh, Policy briefs present a summary of the main research findings together with more actionable recommendations that could improve the use of learning assessment data. So we hope it will facilitate a dialogue among uh, national and international actors and that we will reach national planners and policy makers or any other actor that indeed uh, has to work with or use learning assessment data. We also hope that it might inform international actors' um, initiatives in this area. In our project countries, we found very interesting good practices when it comes to the use of learning assessment data. Notably, the Gambia and Namibia both made a very significant effort to use learning data at the school level so that it can really inform activities of principals and teachers.